All right, guys. I just want to know, you know, they say Subaru retain this value and all that, and I get it. But this is the problem I have when it comes to, you know, they say buying used car is better off than buying brand new because when you buy brand new, take it off the lot, it loses value. But when it comes to Subaru, you know, any model really, but I'm just looking at this one for now. And, it, you know, when it comes to the fact that Subaru retained this value, this is the problem that I have when it comes to buying a used or brand new. Now, this is a 2018 with 6,000 miles, 28,899. Now we look at a 2019 with zero miles with the same package, the, the Harman Kardon audio, you know, the eyesight and all that, same package. We compare apples to apples. It comes out to 3520. So when we look at 29,000 practically, where we at the mid range of 30,000, you know, this is the struggle because practically, <laughs> I mean, it's not too far off. You know, we're talking about a few hundred bucks off. When you really think about it. You know? So this is a struggle. What is that, like a thousand, what, thousand seven hundred? Practically, thousand seven hundred off? I mean, I'll be honest. <laughs> it, it makes me want to get the brand spanking new zero miles first owner and clean. You can't go wrong for, for seventeen hundred extra bucks. I don't know, man. This is my opinion. It's just, it's crazy. You know, unless you're buying like from a, a private party sale or something like that, you know, I don't. When you when you when you buying a used a used car that's barely you know used, it, it's just like it doesn't. It's not worth to get it to save seventeen hundred when you compare apple apples. Now, mind you, it's not just apples apples. This has six thousand miles already on it. Six thousand miles. I mean, you know, it's it's quite a few. You know, it's driven a few. Even if you say this is highway, it's still six miles on it. I mean, uh, uh, yeah, six, six, six thousand miles, not six miles, six thousand miles. And it's a 2018. Now, granted, that's nothing. You know, 2019, 2018 is only one year, but still, six thousand miles, and for an extra year, you know, clean first owner, I think it's worth to pay the seventeen hundred dollars to get, you know, to get the the brand new Crosstrek. Zero miles. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Like, subscribe. Take care.